Hi, I'm Heather here with 107.9 The Link and Dermot Kennedy before his Link Lounge appearance at Birdsong Brewery. Um, and today we're going to play speed gating. Um, so I'm going to ask you a couple of questions. Mm -hmm. They're really bad because, as you know, speed dating is really bad. Just, just a bad experience <laughs> for everybody. Yeah. Um, but before we get into that, uh, you may have heard his song, uh, Outnumbered, played on, on The Link. And it's been kind of an international sensation. You want to talk a little bit about it? Yeah, for sure. I mean, um, that song was written a good while ago. And and it just instantly kind of became important in the whole journey. It became important in what it means. It became important. It just felt like the right next step for me to take. And so just we got there eventually. And it's always funny when you bring out just one single because you very, at least I personally get very sort of like nervous about how your current fan base are going to receive it and uh, it just it went well again so I'm just I'm happy I'm like I'm getting more confident and every time I release something to be honest does it surprise you which ones take off versus uh, yeah a little bit sometimes especially lyrically you're not sure I find it interesting to see what the world connects with you know and, and I think that helps me learn too and will probably inform what I do next but uh but yeah, it's 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 all learning to me. You know, I've never, I've never. The people kind of ask me like how I made the album and all that, and it's like I did my best. But I, it was my first album, so right. I just figured it out. <laughs> and that album is without fear, and you can uh, get it now everywhere. Yes, um, so into these speed dating questions. Go on. Um, so the first one is, what do you do to wake yourself up in the morning? Uh, I have this really strict like vitamin regimen these days because I just like you live on a bus and you're just constantly at risk of becoming sick I'm sick right now so oh I, I yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, so uh, so I, the first thing I do is like I, I have like these four different bottles lined up with a bunch of vitamins that's what I do and then coffee yeah vitamins and then coffee exactly that's that's good yeah. um, so what's the strangest food you've ever tried strangest food I've ever tried that's a good one uh I had I went to this restaurant in Stockholm in Sweden while we were there and uh, it was beautiful but there was this one thing and it was like reindeer heart wrapped in moss and it was really cool and the chef like hunted the reindeer himself and it was like it, was it, it tasted good yeah sorry yeah I know it, like it wasn't gross that's so. surprising to but me. it was definitely the weirdest a heart covered in moss I know yeah it doesn't yeah. sound yeah. Um, appetizing no um uh, so, are you a sweets person or a salty person? Sweets. sweets? Yeah, for sure. Yeah. yeah, we had catering on a tour that recently and there was dessert every day and it was mm -hmm. just, it was a bad day. Yeah. <laughs> um, do you like crunchy peanut butter or smooth? Uh, <laughs> smooth. Smooth? Yeah, yeah. Um, Neither, what, though. What's I'm that? afraid. What's your favorite breakfast food? I know you do your vitamins and then coffee. Do you eat breakfast? Or? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, poached eggs. Mm -hmm. Yeah, classic poached like egg, Instagram yeah. disgraceful brunch thing, like Instagrammable smoked salmon, poached eggs, and avocado. So yeah, that would be me. Being that this is your first time in Charlotte, mm -hmm. have you tried any of the local food? Yet? Not yet. No, like I'm literally straight off the bus, and and I was trying to find somewhere to go. So where should I go? Um, there's there are a lot of great places. Really? Uh, Maybe I should do that. Yeah, I should do that after this. Yeah. Yeah, just you know, sort of explore. Take some time. Well, it's uh, about time for you to get on the stage. That is true. So this is Dermot Kennedy, and uh, we'll see you next time.